Hello everybody and welcome back to Astroneer with your friend Kuros Paladin. Thank you for joining us. And I just want to start by saying I am sorry about the last episode. I did not realize somehow right at the start of that episode um, I had set the mic gain on my microphone to uh, infinity. So basically it wasn't mute. It was just... Uh, Oh, what's that on the ground? What's that on the ground, little guy? What's that? What's that? Okay, anyhow. Um, I somehow had just set it to infinity with, uh, and therefore it was the, uh, the same as mute. I don't know what happened. So this time I verified it's working out okay. Uh, between episodes, I went ahead and I completed laying out the base here on Novus. So you can see we have a base now. So we unpacked this and did a little bit of uh, flattening out. But this is the final base. Uh, so it's looking really good. We've got our uh, Tower of Power over here. Um, and pretty much everything I need, I do not have a trade platform at the moment. Which is a little bit dis uh, disappointing because... I really want just one Sphalerite. That's all I want is a Sphalerite so I can paint the ground green because I don't have an inhibitor mod and I don't want to make a trip all the way back to uh, all the way back to Silva just for you know an inhibitor mod or for one um, uh, one Sphalerite so what I'm gonna hope for can I keep no I was hoping I could keep sliding there uh, is that I can find some down here now, I did do a little bit of wandering around, and I did not find any uh, between episodes. I was wandering around down here, and I don't know if I have to go further down, if it's two levels down, or if it's just one level down. I know it is available on every planet, so it's got to be down here somewhere. I just don't know where. It might even be on the surface. Okay, I'm going to get lost if I am not careful. I saw the tether lines over here somewhere. There they are. Yep. Oh, what's that? What's that? Nothing. Okay. Um, let's get back over the tether lines. And Sphalerite, I can't remember. Is it also possible that it's on the surface of uh, Novus? So that one I also don't remember. So I'm going to go to the Astropedia planets. Actually... Let's see what they say about resources. And then Sphalerite, Sphalerite. Here we go. Silva Caves de Solo Mountains. That's... Really? That's the only places? Huh. I thought it was on every planet. I guess I'm, I'm not going to find it here then. Okay. I thought it was on every planet. Um, and this is obviously not the correct direction. All right, so then I have to go to back to DeSolo or Silva to find my Sphalerite. That would explain why I wandered around here for about 20 minutes and couldn't find it. I don't know why I remember it being on every planet, but... Oh well, I am obviously incorrect. And that would not be the first time, and certainly will not be the last time. So... Uh... Kadef and Captain Clueless, unavailable again, sadly, but uh, hope to get them back in-game soon so that we can get the energy level of this series back up, because it's a lot of fun, because uh, we we get a little sidetracked, but it's a little more entertaining, I think, when we're uh, trying things out together, and we have some ideas we're flitting around uh, that we can do to continue this series. So, anyhow, I've got to head back if I want that one darn um, Sphalerite, or I could just head back and, you know, pick up the inhibitor mod that I believe is just sitting there. Um, also, between episodes, I created some resource canisters so that I have plenty of storage. Um, even have a resource canister for scrap. We already got six going here, but like I said, I don't have a um, trade platform, and a trade platform requires iron, tungsten, and compound. I don't have tungsten here. 
so I would have to get tungsten. So I think I'm going to be heading back to Silva regardless. So we are pretty good on fuel. Um, is there anything that I want to take back to Silva? Actually, yeah. Let's take these so we can get those going back there. I'm going to leave my terrain analyzers here with the green. Um, there's nothing else here that I needed, right? Um, because Novus offers... What does it offer again? Let's go back here. Planets. Do, 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 do. It offers hematite and lithium. And I think we have plenty of lithium. We have plenty over on Vasania, without a doubt. So, all right, I'm going to leave these RTGs here as well. Let's go ahead. We're going to head into orbit. So all this just for an inhibitor mod and a little bit of tungsten. Um, Glossier, boy, it's really darn close. Look at that. All the planets are really close. Whoa, and we went right through that one. And their base just happened to be right there as we entered orbit. Okay, so first things first. I'm going to grab that. That. Let's get these going. That way they can cook while we're doing the rest of our stuff. Our cherry and... Uh, what it, this would be cherry, or it looks more like a tomato uh, flavor, but I don't know what flavor that would be of bubblegum. And this would just be regular old bubblegum flavor, I suppose. There we go, okay. So we got those going. So we've got some pretty good bites coming in. I mean, we should have more than enough. There's some... Stuff coming up pretty soon, and probably about a week. Uh, we're going to have some new items coming out, I'm hoping. They keep saying end of March, and I'm I'm thinking probably the 30th of March, which is a Tuesday, which they tend to release on Tuesdays. So let's go ahead. I wanted sphalerite. Where did I store sphalerite? Uh, compound or organic. That's my big three. Uh, graphite, empty, quartz. So, nanocarb, these are probably going to be my re uh, composite type things. So, sphalerite is going to be over here somewhere. Zinc. Actually, yeah, zinc is what I really need. Because sphalerite is what turns into zinc. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Ah! Mouse got out of control there. All right. And then I needed tungsten. So do I have... I think we had a tungsten shortage. We did. So I'm going to make a trip back to Novus via DeSolo. Which, of course, has Svalorite. I guess I didn't have to come back here. <laughs> I guess I could have just went straight to DeSolo. Um, I have an inhibitor mod here, but I'm just going to make another one. Then I can just leave it there. Actually, how much zinc did I have? 104. Let's just do this. 1, 2, 3, 4. That should be enough. I'm going to just create some more uh, terrain analyzers and get some more colors while I'm over there. Because all I have at the moment are those greens and these browns. I think that's black, and then these uh, kind of these beige colors, so I can get some of those purples over there on uh, Novus. All right, so I've got all that. I have a fairly good base. I'm pretty sure we have a very good base over on DeSolo. I guess I'll find out one way or the other, right? So let's go ahead. We're going to launch to another planet. over to DeSolo. Oh, and it just went over the horizon. That's okay, though, because we can one, two, three, speed things up.
And one, two, three, slow things back down. It has been a while since I've been to DeSolo. Oh yeah, we got a good base here. Hello, DeSolo. Okay. Let's flatten that out. And flatten that out. And look at that, there's a Sphalerite just sitting there. All my storage was folded up for some reason. Look at this. It's all folded up. There we go. Okay. Um, power is an issue over here, though, I see. I do have generators, so I can run generators if needed. Um... Boost, wide, narrow, inhibitor. Let's go ahead and print one of those. I guess the best thing would be just grab the tungsten I need and then I'll head to uh, back over to Novus where I have plenty of power. I need to get some RTGs over onto this planet. So I am going to print a medium storage. Hope that there's enough power there. We can do this. Get that generator going. I like how the generator vibrates, but the the carbon attached to it just is static. That's some pretty impressive, uh, pretty impressive uh, control there. All right. Um. Oh. That's not what I wanted. I wanted to unpack that. There we go. One, two, three, four, and then we'll put the inhibitor mod over there. Um, I could probably get away with grabbing one more of these, but let's go underground and find some tungsten. I hope there's some nearby. I just have to remember where I went underground. Gosh, look how quick the daylight hours are on Novus. Or, I'm sorry, it's just solo. Here it is, it's over here. Right? Yep, here it is. Okay. I'm pretty certain there was a giant deposit. Oh! No? Okay, yep. And I think I remember a giant deposit over here somewhere. Although... This just kind of ends. Was there another... Oh, okay, it does cont... Aha! There we go, okay. Let's sniff some roses. Oh, look at this. We have a chest piece right here. We have a... Oh, we have two of them. Oh, well, I gotta get the other one. Hang on. I gotta get this one, because it's a knight. We've gotta rescue all the knights. There we go. Okay. So we have a queen... What was that? A queen? Or a bishop? A queen. Alright. And I think I see some over here. Yep. Nope, that's quartz. Although, I... There might be some more from right there, but let's follow these... Actually, right... Yeah, right here. Okay. Oh, that's resin and wolframite. And something else. Wolframite, okay. Let's grab you, put you here. I should probably get an auto extractor up here on DeSolo so we can get some more Wolframite going. Come on, just two more. And 
showing there's some down here. Three. One more. Come on. I really should get a boost mod. Although there's not enough power to uh, operate one here. so close. It's showing there's some here. There we go. It's over here. There. Oh, and it popped out. Okay. I ended up with five. Okay. Well, we'll carry this one back up. Oh, that is not what I wanted to do. Okay, hang on. Now I'm messed everything up. There. Right? Nope. How did I do this? Wow. Did was it up here? No. All right, we'll just grab that one there. All right. Yep, definitely gonna need to restock our tungsten supplies. So if I have some time, I'm going to uh, come back here, we're going to set up an auto extractor for tungsten because obviously I don't have enough. So we have two queens now, and a knight. I didn't have to... Oh look, there's a zinc... Oh, that's one I just did. Uh, just refined. Okay. Alright. Let's just check out our vehicles over here. We got some trash and a buggy. And another buggy over here. I think that was from long ago when Captain Clueless and I went searching for the Lunar Rover. Or the Lunar Lander, I should call it, really. Alright. Off to Novus. A lot of work just to get some paint, right? Novus. And then I don't remember which one of these two is going to be the landing pad. Oh, I got it. All right, let's go ahead and get these going. One, two, three, four. And then... Did I... I did it, didn't I? I did a stupid... Ugh. You know what? I just... I need to pay more attention. What did I do with that inhibitor mod? <laughs> I don't remember what I did with it. Oh my gosh. Really? I must have dropped it off. I, I'm i just flummoxed. Okay. <sighs> Alright, well. You know what? So much for that idea. So, 10 minutes, or almost 15 minutes wasted on all of that. This is happening to me more and more often in my later life. Um, but, you know what? Let's see. What was it that I needed for the trade platform? Iron Tungsten Compound. I have the tungsten now, so we can do this the really long way now. I'm determined. 
I really am. And I have my assistant astroneer here butting her head against my hand at the moment. Hematite and hematite. So we have tungsten compound iron. Print station is right over here. Trade platform. And let that print. And then I am going to need. Yep, I am going to need somewhere to put it. So, the, re the, the layout while that's printing. So the idea was, vehicles can come by here, and the most common things that you're going to do when you are with a, uh, you know, you have a vehicle, are right here. So the shredder, the research chamber, and then I'm thinking about putting right over here the trade platform. Um, or I may move, swap. I'm going to put a platform here and then move this over there because then you can just drop research and scrap off right there. Scrap off. That sounds kind of... That's a funny sounding phrase. So we're going to need our three resin. We'll let this thing finish printing. Boom. Come back over. Large platform B. Okay. And then buried underneath, probably, where is it? Um, underneath here somewhere is the base to this. Because you can't do anything with those bases. Although, I'm wondering what happens if you pack one up and then unpack it. Can you then pick up the base? I'll have to try that. I think I know why they don't let you pick up the bases, because they don't want you to pick up the entire thing, you know, um, before it's been opened. But it would be nice if there was some sort of a flag after you've uh, unlocked it that would allow um, would allow you to pick it up. Okay, I don't know why that got so far off. So that was perfectly fine. There. Okay. Done. Let's bring this over here. I'm trying to get this out of the way. Unpack. Kind of parallel. Oh, I got the... That's good enough. Hook it up. Let me hook you up. Lock. Then we can just move that over there. Put that there. Boom! And then, last but not least, we want Sphalerite. Please tell me I can tra trade for it. Yep. One scrap gives me two Sphalerite. And that's all I need at the moment. Oh, I oh now I remember. It's over here. Gosh, you know what? So how many of you caught that? That I had it over here the entire time. I it was bugging me though. It's like I know I printed the darn thing. I know I did. Alright. Enough. Let's get rid of these ugly grays and such. 
and get some nicer color around here. I like green. Oh, and you can also see I buried a platform underneath just so that astroneers don't suffocate while they're in the middle of this. They can hang out without suffocating and still get power. And there's my sphalerite that I thought I needed, and I don't. Because, you know, brain farts. I had a co-worker long ago when I worked for one of the big three um, who had a jar on her desk, a little clay jar that was just labeled brain farts. Yeah, just at least get rid of the gray. The gray is what I just don't like seeing mixed in with everything else. And then eventually I'll probably get around to actually paving the roads black. Um, like I did in my big save. But for the base I want a nice green just to make it look like home. Astroneer wants to be home. Of course, where is... We don't know anything about the Astroneers. You know, they've never said that they're human. They could be just, you know, giant blobs of jello in these suits, for all we know. So, what does the Astroneer home world look like? Alright, I think uh, for right now, this is pretty good. I might get some accent colors in there, you know, some lighter greens, just to make it look like there's some gradation, and it's not just one solid painted color, as it is right now. Um, but I don't think anybody really wants to watch me doing that. I mean... How many of you want to watch what I'm doing right now? Probably not many. But boy, what a... what a! <laughs> I just can't believe my brain just can't remember these things anymore. It's kind of scary. Um, but oh well. Alright, uh, let's go ahead. We're going to pull that back. We're going to pull that back. We're going to put you there. Put you there. Okay. Um, I'm going to leave all of them here including the inhibitor mod. There we go. All right. So I think, you know, that was a lot of time wasted just to paint the ground green. Now, it could have been a lot faster if I had been paying attention, but then it wouldn't be as funny, would it? You can make, you know, you can laugh at the fact that I cannot remember things anymore because <laughs> I've got to. I've got to find humor in that somewhere. Um, so for our next episode, you know, we've got Glossio done. We've got I think we've got bases pretty much established on all the planets. Um, Does Solo could use a little bit of love as we saw. It just needs a couple of RTGs and maybe a little bit more. Um, but look at this, we've got a fully functioning base here on Novus now. It's a little bit weird because the planet is so small and I went flat from this. And then, I mean, just watch, this is one flat, you know, technically flat surface, but just wandering this far, it actually starts to bl uh, bowl upward. And it's just because the planet is so small, that effect is so noticeable. Um, a true flat would still be nice. Um, not one of the vertices, which is a nice tool, but that's only on creative. Um, but something that's flat, you know, gravity. You know, hey, what is perpendicular? What plane is perpendicular to the force of gravity? Uh, at you know, like say. Right here at my astroneer's feet, right here, what plane 
is perpendicular to the force of gravity. Um, that'd be a neat tool to have. So, but enough about that. We've got our nice little base here. It looks a little bit nicer now. It doesn't have all that ugly gray, black, uh, purple. Um, we have the extra zinc. I could go around and collect some more colors if I wanted to. Um, because we do have some more zinc over here. And I could create some terrain analyzers. There we go. Now I know I was just talking about uh, True Flat. There is the alignment mod, but I have never got that to work reliably. Um, for getting a flat surface. So, I don't know um, if it's a good choice for that. I'm going to try something here. I know I already have some, but... We're going to get... Pre we're going to prepare. I want some of this black. So what we're going to do is, I need to turn that on, and then one of these, it is active, and then black. Beep. There it goes. Alright, and now I have black. And then I've got... Um, i got a couple shades of purple here. I've got this one, and then this one. Let's go ahead, we're going to grab this one. Except I should get near power. There we go. And it filled up. Excellent. Okay. So I got purple and black. So can we paint with all the colors of the soil? I already had black, but I like it because I can pave roads with it. So we've got purple. We're going to put that back over there, okay. And I'm just going to put this extra zinc here for right now. Because we have hit uh, 30 minutes or so, so folks, I hope you had a great time. Yeah, this is another one of those episodes that didn't go very, you know... It was a little bit slow. Um, I want to make things more interesting for folks. Um, I want to get Kadef and Captain Kulis back in because I got some really great ideas that we've been discussing, kind of like building our own little towns. Um, but that requires a lot of coordination, and hopefully we can come up with something in the near future. You know, before I end this episode, I just saw something. I want to build a bridge. I want to bridge the gap. I want to build a bridge to... my uh, satellite that I discovered over here. And that shouldn't be too difficult to do. All you gotta do is... First of all, find a try that will work out right. Maybe that one? And we'll get rid of the floaty bits in a bit. Oh! What do I got going? Oh, the drill is still going. There we go. We don't need the drill because we're depositing soil. And I just realized I'm going to take out that pop coral. Oh, look at that. I got a re That was a pretty good guess on that try. Look at that. Wow. Actually, and I can even leave the pop coral there. Wow. That was a really good... You know, I don't know if I could do that again. That was just 
almost perfect. And we can even leave the pop coral. But there, now we got a little bridge that goes over this canyon. Let's get rid of the floaty bits. There we go. Super. And then what we can do... Just so that it is, uh, you know... You can get over there without fear of suffocating. But yeah, our satellite that we discovered so long ago... Um, which one was it? The Mariner X. Alright, so there we go, folks. That's where we're going to end the episode. I really appreciate everybody hanging out to watch, and I will see all of you in the next episode of Astroneer with your friend, Kuros Paladin. So everybody, I hope you had a great time, and I will see all of you in the next episode of Astroneer. Take care, and bye!